the barbell glute bridge, an alternative to the hip thrust that works the glutes through a shorter range of movement and allows the use of more load. From the side here, we see the bar still sits over the top of the pelvis, we drive through the heels and contract the glutes hard at the top. Don't place the feet too far away from you. If you struggle with driving through the heels, simply place small plates underneath your toes and it will force you into a position where you're able to drive appropriately. You can see from this position that the knees make a roughly 90 degree bend as you hit full hip extension. Performing posterior dominant exercises with a bare foot or a flat shoe allows greater engagement of the glutes. As we look from the front, we want the knees to stay in line with the ankles and the hips. We don't want to see them drift together. Full glute contraction requires a slight posterior tilt in the pelvis. This position is what it looks like. This is an overarched lower back rather than hip extension. To correct from this position, place your hands on your ribcage, lower down, clench the glutes as hard as you can and slightly tilt and flatten that lower back. To recap, drive through the heels, pull the knees ever so slightly apart, contract the glutes hard at the top with a slight posterior tilt.